So we have Dan the Man, Lucario Bowser, and Game and Watch versus mm -hmm. Leanne, Peach, Pikachu, and Ganondorf. I think we'll see that uh, Game and Watch. If Dan loses, I would have thought if he. But might, you know, think. Oh man, I've got a little. Yeah, I can go. There. <laughs> Why not? Because if uh. Like if he wins game one, you can be like, oh, I'm gonna stay. But then again, I, I would say that Dan's Bowser, I mean, Dan's um, Bowser is better than his game one. Probably. Let's see, how many up throws can Bowser get? Because that's definitely what he's going to be fishing for. As much as Peach is gonna try and stay in the air, he generally likes to float within his grab range. But if she can just stay like full high enough to the point she doesn't get punished. I don't like that height. That's like the height that Peach likes to stay at, and I'm gonna grab the little grabber there. Okay, so she's she's going higher with each little jump it seems, so she she uh she might be catching on. Um down throw from Bowser, probably miss input. Uh I feel like this is a prime uh, up throw up air percentage for Bowser. So even with this percent I feel like he can do it. Especially <laughs> Oh, Ooh, oh the, the mix up the jab and the jab down, to down B. I think it's the what they do, they jab and they crouch like to cancel frames or whatever, and yeah. then they do down B. Um, that's a really good tool for Bowser. And especially on shield. Oh man. Better try and perfect shield that or you're dead. Oh, oh man. Yeah. Right, no so no directional right, so. influence from uh from Shy Babe there, just letting it happen. I think I don't think she knows how to counter that. That is something I feel like you would take for granted. Like it seems so simple, you know, just hold the opposite direction, but she doesn't know how to counter it then. Are we gonna see Ganador? Are we gonna She's see Ganondorf? Are we gonna see Ganondorf? Last time, Leanne beat Dan with Ganondorf. Yeah, we're gonna go see Dan with Ganondorf. I thought you were banned from commentary. Go! You're frog. He's got, he's got one game to be polite. And he's out of here. Alright, so apparently this is a little run back for Leanne and uh, Dan the man. Up the condos? Oh. Dropping a little early. Probably could have gotten a little. Dan's shield looking kind of small right now. The two down Bs. But it's Smash 4, it's probably already back. Mm -hmm. That's the thing I hate about uh, Ganon's down B in midair and on shield. It like pressures your shield and it takes a lot of shield down. What's your other character? I don't know, I feel like Ganondorf deserves something. He tries to get the jab one in to grab. Uh, pushes him off the edge though for too much knock back there. <laughs> Is that actually true? Jab and a grab? I feel like at low percents it's really good. Not true, but really good. Almost, almost like that. Get the dot. Not quite a Donkey Kong, but ooh. again, so much sheer. Ooh. ooh. Ooh, and she takes one stock. Amazing. That was a tough situation. If he had kept that shield up, he would have gotten broken, but obviously trying to act out of that just got him. Oh. Amazing. I think bad DI there. Yeah, that but... was questionable DI. Oh no. Oh <laughs> no. God, well, she's going for it. The E Serpent Special. Yep, it's time for the standoff. Wish be making it a 2v1. <laughs> Definitely Ooh. trying to help out Cranando there. Now Shaibe is playing very patient. Definitely just kind of waiting for Bowser to approach, which he inevitably will for these grabs. Nice tech chase read. Shy Baby is trying to take advantage of the uh, sound uh, of the Wispy. stage. Wispy definitely adding on the extra element to this. Oh. oh my god. This match. This is, it's such a quirky match here. I love it. Firm. Right now, yeah, she's, like you said, um... Up, up. At this percent, I feel like we can get the up. As you said, uh, yeah, she's basically letting Dan approach. Oh, that could have been up smooth. <laughs> yeah, Dan's shield has oh, yeah. never been in a good place. I did. Oh. Nope, doesn't go for the up air. Oh, oh Dan's trying to disrespect. Ever. I don't feel like any of these players are trying to not disrespect. Well, she tries to go for a roll, I guess. That's why she did a side it's smash. Well. An edge guard? No, oh, nope, guard. he's Bowser. Gonna live everything. Except oh, that! Oh, and drops a shield and S smash. He was too afraid for his shield, which honestly I would have been too. 
Bo Shy Day. It happens. It happens. <laughs> it happens. We're gonna see a game and watch. I would be interested in seeing that. However, it would be interesting because uh, Dan kind of got hit by a lot of stray smashes. Mm -hmm. He cannot do that as a game and watch. He will die sooner than he would. So I think it was smart of him to stay. Also, if I don't um, remember, uh, Dan did take a little break from answering also, so he could be stuck on tilt, because I remember he didn't answer last week or the week before that also. This came and brought us set up. It's always hard to get off of the break, but hopefully Battlefield can give Bowser the advantage and he side me will kill much earlier than him. No. Doesn't go for the uh, up tilt confirm there. Oop, Ganondorf does not have a jump. Oof. I was going to say, it was smart of him to stay away from that ledge. If Dan misspaces neutral B while he tries to edge guard, if he can hop on the ledge and try to like counter the trade with that will put Dan in a type of off stage. Dan can edge guard him. But uh, Bowser down air, poking through the platform, that's a weird mechanic also. Like, Bowser has some jank hitboxes. I feel like as though every down air, like, it shouldn't go through any platform. Most of them. Barely making it back due to those magna hands. Uh, down tilt, Ganondorf can certainly live this. No fire to try and interrupt it there, but who needs chip damage? Nice up yeah, Up at a shield is also good for Bowser. It's also. so fast. Again, this isn't this isn't Game Watch. Not gonna kill yet. But hopefully, he doesn't run into fully charged smash, but that's definitely. Yep. Definitely a scary game three situation here. I feel like it could still go either way. Both of these characters, you know, heavy, but you know, single hit. Thing is, uh, probably it will be 50 50 in this matchup, right? Oh, okay. Well, uh, up till 50 50. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like as though Bowser has a massive advantage. Um, for, I know for Donkey Kong, it is incredibly easy for him to get his cargo, cargo up throw kills, so I would imagine the percents are greater for Bowser. Oh yeah, that's right, because Bowser does have kill confirm. Mm -hmm. Other than um, Ganondorf, you have to rely on the read. Yeah, Ganondorf, they hit about just as hard, but Ganondorf has a much harder time getting Nice of Dan the Man, just kind of waiting out Liam to do anything, because Ganondorf is so high commit, and then just punishing accordingly, because yeah. Bowser has the speed. Yeah. See that down B? It's a side B? It's a no bit. <laughs> yeah. Dan's fishing off these grabs. He wants uh, he wants Ganondorf off stage, but again, like that's a scary situation. This big lead could instantly turn sour. I have a, fi I have a feeling that Dan really wants to fish. He's waiting for the shield. But at the same time, any any attempt, you know, you know, that's a lot of risk there. Uh, what is it? High risk, low reward? Exactly. That dude grabbed me sitting down with <laughs> For some reason, other That probably, platform. yeah, that wouldn't work <laughs> with the platform, <laughs> but oof. are just kind of running up, running back, trying to bait something out of land so we can punish, but they're both just very scared to do anything. If Leanne can get a oh, smash attack... Whoops. DI? Oh, okay. DI. Oh, oh. <laughs> DI. Okay. Leanne's cheering. I'm taking a wild guess that if Leanne lands an F smash on either side well, of the that's platform... A, that's gonna that's be it. It. But if she were to land an F smash on Bowser, he would have died. Facing the blast zone. Probably. Probably. Either way, great set. Nice game three. Very uh, tense at times.